you are an individuated unit of consciousness and very specifically there's a 99.9999 for probability that your life is driven by fear by ego by beliefs by needs by your wants by desires that your life is suboptimal because of that your life isn't as happy and joyful as it could be because of that understanding virtual reality yourself as consciousness where you fit in the big picture consciousness evolution what it is you're supposed to be doing here will enable you to do it much better if you understand it that's all coming with virtual reality so what it'll mean to you is that you your neighbors and everybody else on the planet will start realizing that they have a purpose here and it's to grow up and it's to lower the entropy of their consciousness and that means caring becoming love not ripping people off not trying to figure out how you can get other people's money out of their pocket into your bank account you see not struggling letting go of the fear letting go of the ego living a life of joy and peace and cooperation that's where it leads and if that sounds like something good then this physics about virtual reality is what is going to cause that something good to happen eventually we have to start someplace and now is the time because virtual reality has become a thing in physics departments it's taken seriously now thousands and thousands of physicists think virtual reality is a good idea they haven't yet got to the point that consciousness is the computer but that's the only logical answer once people start thinking about it that answer is going to come up because there is no other answer and besides that we've been talking about this now for since 2002 when i published my books and there's a whole lot of people out there now thousands and thousands of them that understand how all this works so we will turn that corner and hopefully turn it very smartly to where once we get the virtual reality within the next decade we'll get the consciousness as the computer which in the next decade we'll get love as the answer so that's only a couple of decades away you're, you're likely to live to see that and be a part of it see that's why it means something to you having virtual reality become an acceptable thing by the scientist is just step one in a series of steps that will end up making your life the life of your children and your grandchildren so much better than your life has been that you won't even be able to imagine it 